What is going on everybody? Welcome back. Ruben with Texas All Water Fishing. And well, I'm here at the house getting all my camera gear together. We are heading offshore. I'm not gonna forget that awesome, awesome 360 camera, but we're heading offshore in the morning and we're gonna be going on a 48 hour fishing adventure with Up Above Adventure. We have a mother and son duel and they're going to be accompanied by some of the son's high school friends and uh yeah it's going to be pretty pretty awesome to be pretty fun i can't wait to get out there I, I already know just from the vibes of talking to the customers and booking the trip i already know that they're we're going to have a blast it's going to be a lot of action a lot of fun a lot of guys cutting up and uh, i can't wait to get out there now, it is amberjack season, and we're going to be targeting some amberjack. Now, if you've never caught an amberjack, um, stay tuned, because I know we're going to get in some. But uh, if you never caught an amberjack, then you're missing out. They are some of the toughest fighting offshore fish out there, and they taste very, very good. And we're also going to be looking for some tuna. Love tuna. We're going to fish some of these rigs and platforms offshore. And we're going to do some vertical jigging for some tuna at night. Yellow fin, black fin, it doesn't matter. They're all great fighters and they're all great tasting and eating fish. We'll probably troll a little bit too and see if we can hook up to some of those real tasty guys. But in the morning, we're going to be fishing for some monsters. Monster amberjack, monster tuna, monster fish. Let's uh, finish getting this gear together and get out there. first stop along the way is to fish around some of these rigs these oil rigs platform to try to catch some bait fish yeah like that cute little guy also known as a chub not just cute little guy but they're pretty aggressive and you can see they're pretty curious we're going to catch some of those and we're also going to try to catch some blue runner trying to catch the little chubs the little guys so you can uh, use them for bait there it goes right there all those guys right there how far down is it? Up right oh, there it is. Right there, there it is. I see it. There you go. Oh. They're normally like real aggressive. They'll, they don't take much to get them to bite. Uh, the key is to put these guys on a big hook, send them down with a lot of weight, and wait for that amberjack to pick them up. If you haven't fished for amberjack, let me just tell you, it is one of the toughest fighting fish that you can get out there offshore. They're very aggressive they get big in size they're huge they're brute they're real donkeys they will pull a lot they will pull you into the rig so you have to be very careful when you have one hooked up you got to yank them out of that rig and you got to really crank on that reel uh, not to mention they taste very good as well there you go That's a big old fat one. Fuck, that's too big. Too big. Too big. is screaming that amberjack picked up our bait with a vengeance he grabbed it and yanked it and started pulling it 
into the rig, the first thing you have to do is you have to clear, clear all lines that are around this line, and you have to get somebody on that amberjack. You have to crank as hard as you can and move the boat away from the rig so you can keep them out of the legs of the rig so they don't break you off. We are tight. It is exciting. Again, a tough fighting fish, and this guy picked up one of the blue runner that we just sent down. Good fish, bro. Good fish. <laughs> what was that on? What bait was that? That was a blue runner. The blue runner? Yeah. Yeah. There you go. There you go. When, when you rest, he rests. We are so close now. Now you can see color. We have to be very careful when gaffing this fish. If you're going to lose a fish, this is where you lose them. You lose them at the boat. Sometimes you can accidentally hit the line with the gaff. Sometimes you can gaff the fish bad. And sometimes the fish just does something funny, just does something tricky and comes off. I would definitely earn that one. Nice, big, beautiful amberjack. The crew, the angler, they all did a great job. Miss Kathy just hooked up to a nice big shark. Fishing with a live chub on bottom. Unfortunately, this shark's teeth are too sharp and our mono leader line is no match for his jaws. And when he wants to go, he just simply takes off and goes, breaks the line, and leave us wondering how big and what kind of shark was it. As the day begins to fade and the sun starts to set, we spend several hours trolling around our next platform the next structure will be fishing and vertical jigging for blackfin and yellowfin tuna overnight. We were played by Barracuda and Shark. Seems like every single time we had a black fin on the Barracudas, the Sharks were just ripping and tearing them to pieces. It almost became a personal challenge for each angler to hurry up and get the tuna on board and keep them away from the circling Barracudas. Let's go, Brad! Make that face, baby! Make that face! Yeah! Did he hit it yet? He's fucking licking Don't let him chops. hit it. Oh, uh, did he get light? Did he get lighter? Fuck him. Yeah. 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 Oh, he's he chasing it. He chasing it. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Uh, hurry, hurry. There he is. There he is. Get him. You got the tail. Yeah, things got a little wild after that. It was 
one heck of a night for the guys. I think we landed somewhere between 20 and 35 black fin and one yellow fin. As the sun was coming up, we started trolling the area and two reels went off, the lines were tight, the reels were screaming, and the mother and son duel jumped on them and started cranking. Nice and smooth when you pull up, nice and smooth. What a fun trip. We had an absolute blast with our customers. It's always great when you have people that come on board and you meet them as strangers. They turn into friends and they leave as family. We caught a ton of fish. The guys had a tremendous amount of fun. This was a great 48 hour trip, nonstop action. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Like the video, leave a comment, and book your trip today.